Hi everyone, it's just Lachlan again, and I thought I would come over here and give you a few good tips on uploading products that have come directly from our tech team. So I'm going to screen share again. So as you can see uh, over here on the product page, so uh, you've got either simple product, variable product, group product, um, you put the sale price in at the general price. Um, as I mentioned before, you know, you've got your categories and your tags and all of that stuff. But the most important tip that I can give you is that you want to have a really good picture up for the product. So in order to do that, uh, you come over here and go add media. But our tech team have very specifically said that the optimum image size is anything that's under 150 kilobytes and has to be around 800 by 800 pixels. So a good tip to do that is to come over here to Canva. So canva.com. Uh, you just log in with your Google account. Um, it's free to use. Um, and then you come over here to create a design. So you set the width and height to 800 by 800 pixels and you go create a new design. So that'll bring you over here. So if you want to upload your own picture, what you can do is you can upload media. So say I want to use the Heptalit logo. Uh, I can bring that over here. Now, the thing is, you've got to make sure that it fits within the boundaries. So in this instance, it doesn't because it's rectangular. But then if I wanted to use something square, I'd come over and make sure that it fits perfectly. So it's optimum to use things that fit perfectly. Don't use things that won't. Otherwise, it might crop weirdly when you upload it. So then after you're done with that, what you can do is you come over here to the share menu and you click download. So you have to set it to JPEG. That images have to be JPEGs. You can't use PNGs or anything else to upload. And then you click download. So once you click download, so that automatically completes it. And then you can see over here, it's downloaded. So see how that's cropped weirdly? Um, that's one issue with using things that don't fit. And that's why it's important to use things that do. So again, with my previous example of the yellow picture, I've got here, you can see it fits perfectly. Now, that image is only 49 kilobytes as a JPEG file. Uh, the Piptal one that didn't fit perfectly was 28 kilobytes. So, you know, it's well within the size limits for what we need. So then once you're done with those, uh, you come back over here, you add the media, so select files, um, and then, you know, you go, that's it. Sorry, I've got quite a few files here. So you upload that one. And then you insert that into the post. So, uh, you know, you have a title for it, the caption, the description, um, set up all that stuff. And then, yeah, basically what you do is you add in all the correct details and then you submit it for a view. And that'll come to us. And um, <clears throat> provided that you uh, that everything fits within the right boundaries. You know, we're not going to let people obviously advertise things that are illegal. Um, and we have a big list of products that uh, you can and can't advertise listed um, in some of, uh, on one of our pages. So I recommend checking those out just to make sure that you're keeping up with all of your uh, obligations as a member. Um, and yeah, again, if you have any questions or issues, please reach out to us at the support at pimplet.com email, and we'll be happy to help you. But um, yeah, those are just a few quick tips, and uh, thanks for watching and happy selling.